By the way, did you see Jen Psaki crying yeah. Yeah. on that podcast? Yeah, Ooh. I did. She was did crying. Did you see that or no? Did no she was, what is she crying She about? was crying because she was, of the... Go ahead, tell the, she, she was crying uh, because of the DeSantis, the law being put into thing where that you can't teach. She's thinking it's the most messed up thing that you can't teach. She's th again. She's saying that it's it's anti you know anti gay. Yeah, she and says, how can you do this to, to kids, kids who are who are going through this? And if they want to be trans, you have to let them be in. And then she starts crying. Says, you don't know how much this hurts me. And I'm yeah. like, I'm like, Actress. I'm watching. I'm like, wait, what? My but, buddy Tim Dillon yeah. had the best take on that. I can't remember the exact tweet, but it was basically like uh, it, one, it, the, he quote tweeted one of these teachers that was like, how am I? Not supposed to talk to if I have a if I tell my students that I had a wonderful weekend with my gay lover, like how why would I not be allowed to do that? Um, and <laughs> Tim Dillon goes, uh, you know, that's cool and all, but my the all, everyone knows that all the best teachers are like this mysterious these mysterious yeah. figures. You didn't know anything <laughs> about them. They came right. in with yep. a ratty jacket yep. and ratty hair mm -hmm. and taught you actually learned shit yep. they never talked about their personal lives you nope. didn't know what car he drove you didn't know Nothing. where he lived yeah and you so, didn't know his first name right no, first no, said, no. mrs williams she's in she's out boom yeah, yeah. and then what was the what was the kicker to that but that's it it was just that you know sometimes his takes are more brilliant than they are you know hysterical but that was it it's like it really got me to thinking like yeah what are we talking about here why yeah. would you need to know your the personal lives of your teacher yeah on any level, not to mention, I mean, it's yeah. just ridiculous. And what you, I don't know about you guys, Patrick. I, the only time I learned about sex as a child, and I remember the room, I don't, I forgot how young I was. It was just a slideshow quick of mm -hmm. the male body parts, the female body parts. It was awkward. Everybody was kind of, you know, giggling. That was it, bro. It was up to our parents, but, you know, Middle Eastern parents, there's no birds and bees. It's just like, you better figure it out on your own. But it was one day in class. Why, why the anger? It's, it, what bothers me is the anger of why. Can't we teach them what we want? It's like, bro, relax. Let the parents teach their kids about yeah. sex and and honey. There's, you know, think about dude, kindergarten. You, you know how confusing it is just to be a kindergarten. Like they're they're kids trying to feel like you're a boy, but you could be a girl. But you could change it on Thursday. You could, it's too much mm -hmm. information for a child, bro. Wait, wait down the road. They're gonna trust me. They're gonna see it if they're watching Netflix. I'm expecting they're gonna see it when they get older. You know what I mean? Yeah, the kids used to figure it out on their own when they when you saw the picture of yeah. the male genitalia. Yeah. Either you felt something in your belly, <laughs> yeah, or exactly. you didn't. Exactly. Or when you saw the female genitalia, you're like, "Ooh, something about that I like." <laughs> exactly. Or you didn't. Yeah. Like there period. was no. They weren't like, "Here's what to do with this." Yeah. Exactly. Okay. Uh, let me. Let me. And you could get rid of yours. I'm going to throw you guys a completely different angle here. With yeah. the, I actually really enjoy that these people are trying to force these beliefs down people's throats because what's <laughs> happening right now. I don't, yeah. I'm not saying whether you're on the left or on the right is that at the end of the day, common sense is prevailing. Of yeah. course. And at the end of the day, people are like, I yeah. don't know about this, yeah. bro. Like, yeah. I don't, why is it like any, t I don't care what side you're on. Anytime you just like, what, what? what's going like on? Like that look, whatever that look, yeah. I just like, what, <laughs> that thing? It's not adding up. It's not making sense. Yeah. And, I, and, and, and whether you were on the, on the left and you didn't see what, or you saw what Trump was doing, you're like, ah, I don't know about this or you're on the right and you're or just a common sense person and you're seeing this don't say gay stuff and this disney stuff yeah. and, then, and you're just like ah you're it's a losing proposition yeah, at the end of the day common sense is what people yearn for yeah and gra what they gravitate to That's and it. if you're on the side of like pandering to your point tony of to like a small segment of society you're gonna fucking lose yeah right but it's it just it just boggles my mind how and i'm not i'm not right i'm not left i'm, I'm just in the middle how this side, this presidency, this administration, they had talked all that trash. Trump's gone, right? Mm. They had all this time to at least pick somebody. They went with Joe Biden, whatever. He's a familiar face. 81 million votes. I still can't believe it. You had all this time to make a, a stand and change and really make a difference. What have, what have they done? And I hate when people just say infrastructure. I don't, I don't care about infrastructure. Everything is going wrong. Nothing is going right. You had all this time. You talked all this shit about Trump. What are you guys doing? And nothing. And they're just... With shit like this, like mm -hmm. the the White House, Jen Psaki is furious and crying because it's not cool not to teach these kids about sex and gender. But they're gonna pay the price for this. I in mean, the there's your seeing. I mean, you're obviously, see it. Yeah, let me I tell think you. So. Let me tell you what's gonna happen. Let me tell you. Okay, <laughs> this is so ridiculous how idiotic they are when it comes down to strategy. Mm -hmm. There's two different ways. What's the saying? Would you rather win the battle or the war? The war. The war. Okay, these guys are all winning battles. Let yeah. me explain. The more they do this, 
Okay, the more they play this game mm. and pushing whatever down kids' throat, mm. uh, every pastor and church right now mm -hmm. is going to be using that message and grow attendance. You're right. Because here's how pastors are going to use it. They're going to say, how many of you are sending your kids to public school? If you're sending your kids to public school and you're worried about the values and the principles, there's never been a more important time to plug your wow. kids into a church because yep. the school's not going to do it. So their stupid ideas and philosophies is going to help the organization they least want to yeah, help. Exactly. And number two, all this bullshit they're feeding a parent who's sitting there who was okay doing what they were doing. Now they're saying, no, my kids are going to go to a Christian private school or a private school that's Catholic or a private school that's whatever that's teaching strong Yep. Values and principles. Mm -hmm. I'll bust my ass to make that additional thousand dollars to send them to private school. Private schools are going to go up. Public school are going to get their asses handed to them. Homeschooling is going to go up. They're, they don't realize how strategy and you know war works. Mm -hmm. It doesn't work the way they're doing it. Mm -hmm. They're idiots. I'm telling you I right now. It. They're I, idiots. I'm seeing it. Short term, they yeah. will win. Yeah. Long look what DeSantis. How do you I think Disney's it. board is sitting right now, sitting saying, <laughs> guys, fifty since nineteen so for fifty five years we've not paid any taxes. Yep. The hell did you guys just do? Yeah, we went woke. Right. By the way, do you know how much money that is? That's insane. Do you know how much money that is? Oh my god! You're not talking about like a couple million. You're talking real money. Billions. That's <laughs> called stupid. <laughs> is what it's called. Yeah. Dumb. Stupid. Yeah. Big you time. made certain things you said that is stupid, and you yep. had freedom, and now you don't. Yep. Now you're paying a price for it. But By the I way, mean, what did they say the other day? Like they're not going to stop calling kids boys and girls. Well, dude. That they're going to only call kids dreamers and fairy bells and or whatever the hell that oh is. And, and, and is this and boys a and girls. Is this a life? And I, I think, Tony, I want to know you guys' honest opinion. I think personally that that whole she, he, the, them, that started because the generation, I think one or two after me, hitting your kids became taboo. Because you know this. If I went to my father and he's like, Vinny, come here. And I was like, excuse me, dad, as a Middle Eastern father. And I went, it's he, them, they, or whatever. He would have been like, they are moving the fuck out of this house today. <laughs> like it's, I'm not saying beating your kids, but that generation where you can't even talk or be like, listen, relax, chill. Like, cause now it's, it's just free falling. I saw somebody that was like, though. they, it was the, on a certain days it was yep. the, them, she, and I'm like, if you think I'm gonna fucking take the time to be like, what's today and what are you? I, I, I can't, bro. That's why I'm moving out of California. See, I, can't do it. I, I have I have two emotions right now: a ton of excitement and confidence, and a ton of fear, <laughs> which combine it together produces urgency. Yeah, is what it produces. Beautiful, and I'm good with that. Yeah, I good. want whatever that produces. If you enjoyed this short clip, click over here to watch another short clip. And if you want to watch the entire episode, the entire podcast, click here.